everyone, a huge honor to have Rabbi J. Yaakov Schwartz. He is the president of Kanfei Shemesh, a fantastic organization. I recommend everyone to check out. I'll put the link on below to share an amazing word for Parshat Vayishlach. Hello, everyone. In, in this coming week's Torah reading, we read about the famous wrestling match between Jacob, our father, and the angel of his arch enemy brother, Esau. Now, the question is, what relevance does that struggle uh, have to us? And we could understand that what Yaakov was, Jacob was really wrestling with was the personification of the potential destruction that Esau um, represented. In other words, our rabbis teach us it is synonymous with wrestling with the angel death. It is synonymous with wrestling with one's own inner inclination towards evil, known as the Yetzer Hara. So it wasn't just a battle um, that was a historical event with an angelic figure. It actually is a primary struggle that each and every person faces in their lifetime, and for some people, each and every day. Because we, if we understand that we have choices for good and for evil at any given moment, then we're in, a, we're in that struggling, we're in that wrestling match. What am I going to do? Am I going to do the thing which is um, kind for others, helping others, honors God, honors the Torah, honors the Jewish people? Or am I going to do something that's personally gratifying at the expense of others? Will I speak in positive terms about every other individual only, including my spouse? And or will I denigrate people using my power of speech in ways that may not be beneficial to people or I may not be so proud of. So that inner struggle, the wrestling with the angel, goes on every day. In terms of the, the, the angel of death, there are many people, especially in this year in Israel, who have been struggling with that angel since October 7th. The horrific death and abuse that people online in Gaza suffered was not limited to the events of October 7th. There are nearly 20,000 Israeli soldiers who are in need of special service and treatment for their trauma that they experienced in their horrific um, battling in the tunnels of Gaza with um, literally agents of death. And it hasn't been completely resolved. So Hashem should give strength to you and to the Jewish people to understand that this is a struggle that we can win. They said the sands under their feet went all the way up to the heavens, the avak, meaning that the struggle, which is another name for avak, will reach the heavens. We hope that everybody, the families who had losses, and especially those who are traumatized and injured, they need our help, they need our support, they need trauma treatment. And I believe the best treatment for trauma is faith in Hashem and kindness from our fellow Jews. To be, to be uh, more informed about how you can help, go to convictshamish.org.